lovely beauties. It's your girl, Allie Beauty 28 So, obviously, um, I told you guys, well, I asked you guys if you wanted a May empties, and a lot of you guys said yes. So, today's video is going to be a May empties because I have a whole bin full of things that I ran out of. So, a little disclaimer slash, if you don't know this already, these are things, um, I, like, um, I could have gotten them, like, a year ago, but I happened to run out of them this month. It doesn't matter, like, when I got them or whatever, I just ran out of them this month. And I think this video will be cool because I can review products because I've had them and I've completely ran out of them, which shows that I know what I'm talking about and everything like that. And some of these products, sometimes... Like, I run out of products rather quickly because, um, I share products with my family sometimes. So, yeah, I don't even know why I just said that, but who cares? Well, let's just get started. So, I'm going to start out with makeup products I ran out of. So, the first thing I ran out of is this Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. And I know it looks like it's not empty at all, which is because it's not empty. Whenever I first started out with concealer, I decided to pick up this concealer, and this is in the shade medium. Who knows why I got this shade medium? It looks really orange on my skin. I absolutely hate the shade. It will never fit me. I'm just throwing it away. I don't know what I was thinking, because you're supposed to get, like, a lighter shade. Um, I like the consistency and everything, just the shade is completely off, so that is bye-bye. And then I also ran out of this e.l.f. eyelid primer and this is like the small sample size and it's just like all dried up and it's not nothing's coming out of it obviously because it's empty but yes I will repurchase this this is only like a buck and it's a great eyelid primer and also the last makeup product I ran out of is my old holy grail slash I don't know if I still love it because I haven't used it in forever this is the Maybelline full lash bloom mascara and this is what the wand looks like. This was a really great mascara. This was like my holy grail mascara for like ever. And now I'm just kind of like eh about it. That's how I am with beauty products obviously because I'm a beauty guru. I keep buying stuff and then I love those. And then I buy new stuff and then I like that better. That's what happens when you love makeup. But I would probably repurchase that. So now I have two like skincare kind of products. The first thing is the Equate Sensitive Cleansing Facial Wipes. These were great. This was like three bucks and it comes with 40 different wipes and I would definitely purchase these. I absolutely love the Neutrogena ones. And now that I tried those again, I don't know if I would be purchased these, but definitely if I was at Walmart and needed new makeup wipes, I would definitely consider these and most likely repurchase them because they're just really great and they got the job done and took off my makeup, obviously. And then I also ran out of this Neutrogena Oil-Free Acne Wash Pink Grapefruit, Grapefruit Foaming Scrub. This is what this thingy-majig looks like. This is like the smaller one and my sister and I shared this and it was great. I personally would not repurchase it because it kind of, like, had this weird scent that, like, dried me out. Like, you know, I felt like I, like, swallowed it and it tasted nasty. Am I crazy? I think I'm crazy, but it, like, had something weird that went on that I felt like I basically felt like I swallowed it. And it had this, like, horrible taste and it made my throat all dry and I didn't even eat it, obviously, because who would, like, open it up and just go, like, and eat it. So, yeah. Clearly, I'm crazy today, but that's why I wouldn't repurchase it. My sister repurchases that stuff like crazy, but I did, I bought the um, one that doesn't have the beads in it, just like the wash, so I kind of repurchased it, but I didn't repurchase the same thing, because I don't like that nasty thing that happened, and I don't even know what I'm doing, so. Sorry if I'm crazy, guys, but that's just who I am. Everyone, like comments below like why are you saying you're sorry because that's just who you are and now i get it now so I'm i ran out of a few body products the first thing i ran out of is this vaseline total moisture aloe fresh light feeling lotion that's what that thing looks like yes i would totally repurchase this it's not something i would use in the winter because it's like super light but i would definitely 100 repurchase this for like going to the beach or just like in the summer because it's really nice and light it makes you feel clean and it still gets the job done by moisturizing and it felt great, and it has aloe in it, and yes, 
I love this, and I shared this with my mom, and she said she would repurchase it too, so boom. Thumbs up to that product. Okay, and then I ran out of this, like, dial soap. It's, like, the red one that has, like, that fruit scent, but not fruit scent. Like, the Galethio thing. I'm trying to explain the scent here, but I don't really know it. It was just, like, a dial soap. We'll, we'll put it at that, and... Yeah. I don't know if I would repurchase it, because my dog, like, ate it, so... Hallelujah. And then I ran out of this CeraVe moisturizing cream for normal to dry skin. Great. I put this on my hands. You could use it on your body, your elbows, your cuticles, your face. For all I know, your armpits. Yes. And then I also ran out of this like perfume. And this is the Love the Baby Soft Cologne Mist. I don't know if it's supposed to be a cologne. Basically, it just smells like exact version of baby powder burn a spray. And I freaking love baby powder, so I bought it. And I would probably repurchase it because I'm addicted to baby powder. It smells so good. I also ran out of some hair products. I ran out of this healthy, sexy hair. Ooh, my hair is just sexy, ain't it? I just said ain't. But it's the soy milk conditioner. I would repurchase this if it was on sale. Um, I don't know. I just, I feel like there's products that are better than this. But I would still repurchase it because it made my hair soft and it smelled good. And the bottle's like pretty cute. So yeah, I'd probably repurchase that. There's just so many shampoos and conditioners that I love that it's, like, hard to pick the ones I love the most. But I probably would repurchase that. And then I ran out of this, like, sample size of the Not Your Mother's Way to Grow Long and Strong conditioner. This is, like, the one flu ounce one. I actually think I'm, like, really close to running out of the full size conditioner. Because, bam, girl, I love this stuff. So I bought the full size of the shampoo and conditioner. So I like that stuff. And then I ran out of this Spring Valley Fast Dissolve Biotin, kind of for your hair, skin, hair, nail. I can't find the fast dissolving kind anywhere. So if Walmart or Target is watching this, get it back in stock. Wow. And then I ran out of this um, hand soap, which is the Bath and Body Works Fall Cranberry Harvest Deep Cleansing Hand Soap. Yes, I would probably repurchase it. I like their gentle ones better for your skin. Like, I, better for your skin. Yeah, I'm just choosing your skin. No, I like this better for, like, my skin. What am I talking about? I don't like this for my skin because it was kind of, like, hard on my hands. So, I like the gentle ones better. There, I can finally talk. And look, it's empty because I just showed you all my stuff. And by the way... When I said that they did it to get these back in stock, I don't even know if they ever had them, but I got it at Walmart. So if Walmart is watching this, please get these back. Because you are killing me. So yeah, why do I keep clapping my hands? Like, that's what I always do, isn't it? I like have this whole big pile of like empty stuff right here. And yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this empties video. I thought it was pretty cool to just go through all my empty stuff and yeah i will see you guys next time comment below if you like this type of video thumbs up this video if you like this type of video comment below if you want me to film more types of these videos bye i want mcdonald's